Hey everyone, it's Jamie. So, I've been using the Neural DSP Nolly plugin since it came out, and then I realised, Jamie, you haven't even done a video with it yet. You just use it in your videos, but you've not shown anyone that that's what you use. So I thought, wow, I've got Nolly's guitar here. Shameless plug, sorry. Carillion, love it. Thanks for letting me borrow it. I'll get it back to you as soon as possible. So I thought, may as well just sit with it now and have a play with it. So let's let's have a look. Let's see how it sounds. But the real reason I'm doing this video is because if you're going to only buy one guitar plugin in your entire lifetime, or maybe just this year, this is the one you should buy. Neural DSP Nolly Suite. Let's open it up and see how it sounds. Got the amp just open, put it in default, just see how it sounds. This looks like a PV5150. One of the great things as well is as you see here this little link icon when you click that it will unlink the head and the cab so when you move this button here on the bottom as you can see the cab will change so our nolly has chosen four of his favorite metal heads four cabs that he likes as well and we've got a nice little lunchbox one i think that's kind of like a boutique and um, prs archon type amp 5150 um i mean it's kind of fairly obvious um this is like a, a crunch it's kind of a crunch almost um, high gain, but not as high gain as a 5150, and then we've got like a clean amp as well, so. But there's also some really good uh, presets, so I'll go through those, the ones that Nolly has made, and then we'll just see what we think of those ones. As you can hear there, it's using some of the um, pedals as well. So there's pedals at the, in the pre and then there's pedals in the post. So that's using the delay in the post as well. listen to some more presets because these are really good. Trust Nolly to make good presets thing. Uh, clean one. Let's try out a clean one. they are. Mm, heavy rock rhythm. What's that like? Nice one. Don't really play heavy rock though, do I? This is set up in drop B, so we need metal. We need some metal. What have we got here? Metal rhythm, there you go.
And like with all presets, you can always change them to your liking. So I would probably put more highs, a bit more mids, maybe a bit more lows, dial the game back a bit more presence. Sorry, I don't want to go against Nolly's what he's what he said. Don't tell him I said it, but I would just do what I would usually do with, with a real amp. pretty good see you can just tweak it a little bit change it to your liking uh, what else is there oh radio effect what's that sound like <laughs> that kind of reminds me of the like intro to Cowboys from Hell like you know the doo -doo 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 but I can't play it on here because this is in it doesn't work what else is there, Nolly? What else? Oh, liquid shred. I don't do shred, but this is my attempt at it. Delay for days, love that. I think what I would do is use the liquid shred one and then change the head maybe to the 5150 type one. Uh, D word I'm guessing is de junt. I can't play gently though. Yeah, I literally can't play gently. I can't play gent, but hopefully that good enough. Not sure. What else is there? Oof, uh, vulgar display. That's obviously um, Pantera. <laughs> That's a good rhythm and a lead tone, because obviously Dimebag did both on his own. Um, let's go through maybe one more and then I'll show you my one that I really like. Oh, Thrasher. See, this is the one that was like almost high gain. So as you can see here, Nolly's got it as a Thrash, a thrash one. So what I would do is maybe just add this pedal here, which is, I suppose is kind of just like a Tube Streamer or Max on OD808. Turn the gain down a bit, because it's too, too much. Give 
give that a bit of a tweak. More bass, more presence, more, oh, more depth on that one. Another great feature before I go into my preset is you can change the mics. So as you'll see here, Once you've found your favourite cab, you can then change the mic position as well. So let's look at my preset, because this is the one that I use all the time. I hope it's not too loud. Also got custom IR that Nolly sent me also because I wanted one f which was a fat boy like my um, Zilla cab that I've got. Let's just see how that sounds. <laughs> So, that was the Neural DSP Nolly plugin. I hope now you can see that if you're going to only buy one plugin this year, or ever, buy the Neural DSP Nolly Suite, because it's amazing. You saw how versatile it was. It's also, in my opinion, the best and closest you can get to sounding like a 5150. There's loads of alternatives out there, but for me, this is the best one, and it's so reasonably priced as well. This plugin is what I would use if I'm just jamming, if I'm recording videos, uh, me and Sam use it to mix the audio as well. I don't just use it to play with, we actually use it all the time. We've used it ever since it first came out. But as you can see, it does cleans, it does leads, it does uh, kind of crunch, it does so many different things. You can also download other people's presets. I'll make my preset available as well. I won't be releasing the IR though, because that one's special for me. Thanks, Nolly. So yeah, I used in this video the Carillion Nolly Get Good special guitar. It's beautiful. I'll do a video on it eventually because I'll be giving it back soon, so I'll have to uh, use it a bit more. Um, but yeah, head on over to their website, there's a link in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, leave a little like, because then I know that you enjoy it. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe, and leave a little comment to tell me what your favourite preset was, or what you thought about my preset, and I'll, I'll see you guys next week with some more videos. Bye everyone!